Hello everyone, in this tutorial we will try to model neural link. So let's start by adding a cylinder and turn off caps. And I will give 20 segments to the height, actually 12 segments to the height and 20 for the rotation. Now I will make it editable by pressing C or you can press here. And I will select all the points and right click and bevel. Check limit and bevel them all the way up. And let's select them all. We have 1000 points. I will right click and optimize. Now we have 500. Now I will select all my polygons and right click extrude inner and give something like 0 0.5 0 0.1 offset and also don't forget to uncheck preserve groups now I will right click and normal scale I will scale them then normal move and last one right click and collapse okay now i will select the top edges and here switch to scale hold control and make some extrusion now Let's select, actually not select, let's press invert selection. Okay, now I will right click and bevel. And let's bevel that, something like that. Let's give it a small subdivision so it will remove all the triangles so we all, we, we all have quads that's nice let's see but don't forget to uncheck edge breaks let's Go here, scale them, and press Ctrl and press points. This will convert all the selected edges to points. And I right click, brush, where the brush is brush, and switch to smooth. And Smooth those points. I will enable snap, but edge snap too. Now I will again do the same thing. Press Ctrl and press edges and make a extrusion. Switch to scale, press Ctrl, and we are going to do collapse. You can do that by pressing U and C. I didn't see it here. Anyway, you can press U and C. Let's make spotting edges. Let's do the same thing here.
Okay, let's put subdivision surface and see all that looks. Can fix here by adding a loop cut. I think that that looks good. But while we are here, let's make another one. So this one will be a little bit different. Let's do the same segments 12 and 12 and 20. And turn off the caps. Make it editable. Select all the points and bury them. And select all the points and optimize. Select all and extrude inner. Normal scale and normal null. I will do the same thing again. Select those edges and invert selection. Let's bevel. Don't forget to add one subdivision. And don't forget to uncheck edge breaks. So this time we have something like that. Press Ctrl again and press U and C. Let's add another loop cut here. And put that object into the subdivision surface. We have some pinching around here, so double click on them. Switch to points and I will smooth them. Let's move them. And press Q. I will slide them a little bit. Okay, that looks perfect. You can do the same thing here. I won't do that in this video. You can also 3D print them, but if you want to print them, don't forget to delete the phone tags. So this is always gonna look like when you print. So before printing, put them into the subdivision surface. And 
and let's queue them to do subdivisions and make the subdivision surface editable. If you in a 3D print, make it that way so you will have a smoother surface. Okay, that was it. Thank you for watching and I see you in the next video. Bye.